Welcome back to another episode of this madness that is the Deshong Tower Challenge. This is Poppy, and um, you guys, today we're making it to the top. I have decided. I don't care how long this episode lasts. This episode is going to end with us cracking open that juicy loot container that's up at the top of this building. Um, I have decreed it, and so it shall be so, as far as I'm concerned. Before we attempt any of that, I just want to show you that I am making steak and potatoes. Who are we even? Um, I also thought, you know, it might be a good idea for us to clear out this floor again. So let's go in here because I know there's people in here now. See, look at them. There should also be people in the bathrooms as well. Oh, okay. Maybe they just died or maybe they just haven't respawned yet. I don't know. Let's see what's going on over here in this bathroom. I don't know, but the purse has respawned. We'll take that $18. Um, yeah, okay, well, let's go kill some businessmen. We're just gonna, you know, sneak past the floors because we could go up to this floor as well and kind of re-clear it out. Um, there's definitely a few more floors that have respawned, uh, zombies, but let's just get in here and see what's going on. How are you the only one? I mean, I'm not complaining, but where's everybody else at? Okay, well... There you go. Oh, you know what I just realized? I made a dew collector finally, first of all, but I could stick the dew collector out here. Also, did this munitions crate? Oh yes, let's go. Okay, lots of great ammo, steel arrowheads and robotic parts, that's great. Can we put this out here somewhere without it falling down? Look, I just made this and I don't want it to fall. Okay, it looks like maybe that's not the best spot for that. It also looks like maybe we've cleared out this floor for now. Um, we are going to go up the staircase, though, and hopefully that will let us bypass all of the other zombies that have respawned. We will put this new collector someplace else. Uh, but let me get rid of this stuff, grab some food, and then we'll head upstairs. So, you're probably wondering how we got here. Um... Because that's the floor with all the ferals. This is the construction floor here. Guys, I fell by accident, so. so which means I'm on the construction floor and I don't want to be here. I want to be in the staircase. Anyway, I guess we're going to, you know, kill some zombies here. Oh, I thought he was a rad for a hot second. I'm so distracted. I just saw green and all the air left my body. Okay, but we broke our leg because we fell. While we're up here, you know, let's just wrench a few things. Like, what is this going to give me? I'm beginning to wonder about, like, springs. There we go. Come on. Because we need springs for our gyrocopter. Um, the other thing is headlights. Um, I know there's a chance we're, or like, we're going to get an engine from when we break down... Uh, the cement mixer, but we're just not gonna do that yet. Oh, we got a battery. Okay, perfect. I'm not I'm kind of doing this backwards Hey guys, is anybody feral? It seems like the answer to that question is no I feel like that's probably the number one thing that I say in this playthrough is is anyone feral? Okay. Ooh, we've gotten quite a few books in our bags here. Uh, we're just going to read the ones we've read already. Get hammered. Scrapping for fun. A forging ahead or a forge ahead. Um. Hi, guys. I'm trying to make it to the stairs. So. Because I'm ridiculous. And I fell down the elevator shaft. Oh my gosh, and I'm getting beat up. Okay, give me that skill point. We love it. I saw another Forge Ahead magazine and a Wasteland's treasure that we already have, but we're going to read it anyway. We're going to come back and get all of this at some point. Honestly, just need to spend a day clearing out resources. 
I just feel like I've been so focused on trying to get to the top or, you know, trying to figure out what we're going to do for Horde Night. Okay, I think the stairs are not far from here. Okay, where, where are you? Where, blah, blah, blah. Who are all you people? Oh, you are feral. Why am I getting bullied by a feral? Now I gotta take a vitamin. I just refuse to pull out a gun. D do we all notice that? I just refuse to do it. Um, okay. We got a raider outfit. Should we wear that? Maybe we should. Wow. So obviously our other armor is a little better for stamina and such and such. But this one is better for... Well, we get the natural crit healing and a heavy armor. I don't know. Uh, hopefully that means we're going to take a hit better because... Lord knows we need to know how to do that. Okay. Oh my gosh. And now I've really broken something. We're going to find the staircase and have to go back downstairs to heal ourselves. Hold on one second. Let me wrench this down. And then we're going to kill these guys and in a much better way. And then we're going to go downstairs and dump some stuff before we head back upstairs again. I should have just stayed in the stairway, but I didn't do it. I am moving so slow because I'm in pain. Okay, we got a forger head, a wiring mag, a scrapping for fun, and a handy land. Look at that. Ooh, I also see a tools digest. Okay, let's continue on. Okay, I think we've made it because... Oh, look at that. This is why we don't want to break that down because so many good resources. Well, at least we've cleared this floor out, even though we weren't planning on doing that today. I think there's a few more zombies in here. Guys, I'm encumbered. I don't have time for you. Okay, I'll be right back. I have healed myself. I am ridiculous. We did make some more glue. I also forgot that I found I got 24 forged iron from... You know, all of that wrenching of things, which is lovely. Okay, we're still moving slowly, but that's okay. Okay, this is the spot with the trees, and I'm going to put the dew collector here. Guys, it's just right on the edge. Is that working? It is. Okay, great. Okay, guys, look, we made it up here. I remember now, this is where I was kind of confused. I, I really don't remember how we get further up. I'm not sure if I need to get into the elevator shaft or not, but I don't care. I'm just going to break this door down because I'm pretty sure the main loot is on the other side of this door. Then we'll put a hatch in the door and we'll fight whoever we got to fight. But also we'll get to the main loot, which is really the goal of today's episode. I'm also really keeping an eye on our infection because we've got enough money. We're going to knock it out. So I've got two honeys right now waiting. I think it's going to stop somewhere around like 11 or 12 percent. And then we'll just go find the other honey. Like, we'll go find a vending machine to buy the other honey. Okay. We have enraged everyone upstairs. Okay, I'm just going to close this door because it'll make me feel safer. Okay, in all of the enraging, I don't actually think there's anyone in here. They're just all upstairs. Okay. We're just going to loot really quickly before nighttime. Let's go, ammo piles. We love it. Oh, that was really nice. Oh my gosh, guys. We're using our lockpicks. We're using our lockpicks. Almost had it in one lockpick. Guys, I made lockpicks, but I left them downstairs by accident. We're going to have to go back downstairs and grab the lockpicks. 
Um, okay, I'm gonna scrap you. Ooh, we found a grave digger mod. I'm gonna scrap the pipe baton, read the book. And what else is over here? <gasps> Another legendary part. Okay, we gotta go get our lock picks. I forgot I was crafting them in the um, workbench and just left them there by accident. Also, it got really quiet, so you know. Oh, food, food, lots of food. I don't see lots of food, but I saw lots of drinks in that one. Nice. Okay, let's run and go grab the lock picks. Let me look through this. Ooh, that's nice. We'll take it and nice. Okay, I'll be right back with the lock picks. I figured out how to get to the roof, guys. I figured it out. I'm ridiculous. Like I said, it's just been a really long time since I've done it. So, the first thing we're going to do, though, is we're going to grab this main loot, finally. And then we're going to go deal with all of those guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we already grabbed that stuff. I grabbed my lockpicks. Okay, come on. I only have two more lockpicks lo left. Oh my gosh, please. What if I have to bang this thing open in the end? Oh my gosh, I hated that. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm so annoyed right now because that's going to take so long to try to break open. I am going to run back downstairs and make some more stupid lockpicks. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh! Okay, things are just wild. I'm gonna guess he fell from the top. I'm just thankful we didn't break anything. Oh my gosh, what's wrong with me? Okay, we made it back to the floor just as my infection popped up one last time. Let's go ahead and knock it out for good this time. And let's finally open this freaking loot container. I want to tell you that there better be the best loot ever inside of this chest. What do you mean? Oh my gosh. I only have... I made six more lockpicks, guys. Oh my god. How do I only have two left? Oh my gosh. That's it. Six more lock... I, I, what? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. But you just can't get into it because they would never understand. I hate this. This is going to take me 12 years to do. Let's go upstairs and kill some zombies. Let's do that. And we will come back to the freaking loot container that doesn't want to open. And we'll, we'll deal with that then. Who else is left? Maybe there's not really many people left at all. Oh, you're left. I'm really excited because lots of feathers. Okay, I think there's another bird, but he's just stuck up there. Let's see, I should probably... Why did he give me a concussion? It's like I can't help but just, you know, be sick or dying in this game. Oh my gosh, Bobby. I was just in my head counting how many lockpicks I've tried to use on that container. Um. Oh. I think it's something like 12 or 13. I have never in my lifetime. Well, let's just loot. We found another battery. I love it. Okay, what's going on up here? A little broken down dew collector. Nice, with a water filter in it. Let's go. So good. And a Forge Ahead magazine. That is amazing. Uh, we got some more baton parts. Some coffee seeds. What do you mean I'm encumbered, lady? What do you mean? Guys, I really do think everyone's dead. 
I think we killed all of them when we were here on the Horde day. Unless there's some people hidden, I'm pretty sure everyone broke out of these containers. Okay, okay, what's going on up here? This is where all the dumb birds were at. Okay. Ooh, I need to go get my arrow. Guys, we did it. We cleared out the tower. Now we just need to build a gyrocopter. Okay. Gosh darn it. We made it to the freaking top. So, give me a second and we're gonna break open this loot container. I'm trying to decide. Oh, plus there's all this stuff that I have up here still. Actually, let's go downstairs and make a few more freaking thingies. Lock picks. And let's give it one more try. Let's, let's see if we can try that one more time. Okay, this is it. If these lockpicks don't work, then we'll just have to bang it open, because I'm not doing it anymore. Okay, guys, this is it. I will hurt someone if this lockpick doesn't work. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Are you kidding me? You've got to be kidding me. Guys, two lockpicks left. Oh, my God. That's it. Seven more lockpicks. This is what I feel about that. Okay. Dear God. I'll be right back. I'm so annoyed. So annoyed right now. One eternity later. Oh my goodness gracious. It is about freaking time. Okay. Guys, I'm so freaking excited about this moment right here. Please be worth it. Please let there be like a shotgun or something in here. I think that's what I'm most excited is about is the idea that maybe there'll be a weapon in here. Okay, here we go. Are we ready? Oh my gosh, here we go. Um. Okay, no weapons, but that's okay. I see lots of money, which is very exciting. I also see a scavenger outfit which I think we're definitely going to wear. Some first aid kits. Another Grave Digger mod. Um, the two times scope mod schematic. Let's just read that. Some ammo. We got a tech planet. Uh, tools digest. A forge ahead. What is this? A dart trap bundle. Okay. Interesting. Okay. And that, of course, has some electrical trap magazines. Let's turn you into casino tokens. And where are we going to put the dart traps at? I don't know. We're going to figure that out, I feel like. I think I grabbed everything here. I'm going to leave the plants until I put more points into um, maybe Motherlode or whatever it is that's going to give me more. Okay, I'm going to run downstairs really quick, yet again. And I don't know, maybe we'll go clear another floor before this episode is over. Actually, I need to go put this thing inside of my dew collector. Give me a second. And that is on this floor here. I also think it's time to chop down these trees. Oh, look at that. Which means it's just going to make us clean water. Okay, I think the last thing we're going to do, I'm trying to remember where we're at. I think it's the next floor that I'm thinking. The one with all the offices? Yeah. Guys, what am I doing? I'm reading magazines. Okay, we're just going to end up doing this a little backwards, right? Nobody's feral. Oh, come on with the real loot bag. We love it. Also, I just want to point out that at some point during this episode, I can't remember when, we are no longer infected. Let's go. Okay, everybody wants to give me the same great heist book. Okay, loot bag, be nice to me. Ooh, nice. Two tech planets. <gasps> we can make a stun baton. Let's go. Okay, that, that right there, that's the winner for this episode is we can make a freaking stun baton. 
Um, okay. Let's reloot this level, though. I'm gonna wait to break down the chairs, computer screens. I really do think that, um, look at us. I mean, we're still wearing sandals, but that's okay. I really do think that we should put our next points into, um, uh, what is, blah, 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 blah. where, where do I need to put these points? Salvage operations. So... I think to uh, to get to at least level two of that before maybe we start scrapping more stuff down. Um, that way we're going to get 40% more resources with a wrench, ratchet, or an impact driver. So like the chairs will give us uh, mechanical parts and we are going to need a lot of those to, um, to make this gyrocopter, so... Oh, wow. Look at all of them. Some of them are still sleeping. Oh, my gosh. Is this my lucky day? After, you know, the game made me spend a year of my life breaking open that chest. This zombie is still asleep over here. Okay, well. Let's do something we haven't been able to do in a really long time. Oh, my gosh. No one saw that. Okay, we got a little bit of money and, oh, a duct tape and some ammo. We love that. Um, okay, what's in this toilet? Toilet pistol. Did we all just see that toilet pistol? Toilet pistol for the win, I tell you. Nice. Um, okay, there we go. We got an arrow back from everybody. We appreciate that, guys. <gasps> I forgot about the safe. Oh, look at that. We got a serrated blade mod. Okay, guys, with the pistol. I love that we found a toilet pistol. The last time it was a purse pistol. This time it was a toilet pistol. Okay. I forgot. I feel like that vending machine works down there as well. Was there anybody back here? No. There's another dog! Oh my gosh! <laughs> See, that's what I get for being a little too confident. Okay, hand ma handgun magazine. Tech Planet. We're gonna go make a stun baton. That's the last thing we're gonna do for this episode. Oh. What's inside the desk? Guys, I also feel like I really want to put some points into, um, into, um, pack mule, which I would never normally do, but uh, who's making pocket mods? I don't have enough anything to make a pocket mod, so we might just have to do it. Hi, guys. How have you managed to stay asleep is the question. <laughs> Okay. All of these chairs will come back and get. Oh, it does work. Nice. A potato. Some corn. Anybody feral? Anyone feral? There's not. Okay, good job. Okay. Uh, 
I think that is it for this floor. Another floor cleared out, guys. Another floor cleared out. Let's grab that armor part, and then let's just head back downstairs. Let's make a freaking stun baton, and then we'll wrap things up for today. Oh my gosh, there we go, guys. We're gonna make this level one stun baton. I haven't read the repulsor mod. Oh, I have read that. Oh, guys, we might actually be able to make this as well. Cause I'm pretty sure, yep, I've got some steel. I've no if you've noticed, I have made this gyrocopter. I feel like I haven't talked a lot in this episode. It's because I've just been annoyed by having to break open that dumb chest. I mean, like, we use, like, more than 20 lockpicks. I have never in my entire life. Okay, rant over. Anyway, <laughs> I made this gyrocopter crafting supplies box to put all my gyrocopter stuff in. So it makes me feel like, you know, we're starting to gather some things, which I love. Um, so let's grab these electrical parts and mechanical parts, which we need so many more mechanical parts, actually. So I feel a little bit like slow down on the mechanical parts there, girl. Um, let's see. As nighttime falls, we've got some more water, which we're going to use to make glue. Okay, give me a second to gather all of this and we'll make the repulsor mod as well. And there it goes, guys. Look at that. Look at that beautiful stun baton. And we made the repulsor mod. Um, do we have a concussion? Yeah, we do. Do I have... I don't have anything for that. So, um, we are concussed. But, you know... <laughs> today was a wild one, basically, is what I want to say. Um, we do have a concussion. We did spend way too much time having to break open that chest, but the victories today, we made a stun baton and a repulsor mod, and we made it to the top. We cleared everyone out, thank goodness, and we are no longer infected. So I feel like the good far outweighs the bad. Gosh darn it. Okay, next episode, I'm thinking, I mean, we're going to have our stun baton. We're just going to continue making our way back up and clearing out the floors that have respawned so we we cleared this floor out today and then the floor above us and so by tomorrow there's probably another two or three floors upstairs that need to be cleared out so we'll do that thank you guys so much for joining me and i will see you in the next episode okay bye